The Alpha Moles is under there. Yeah, right under the ground. It's just stuck on the cliff. What is going on, guys? And welcome back to another episode of Ark the Center. Last we left off, we tamed a bunch of Zephactinus. So if we look down here, as you can see, we've got our two best Zephactinus just breeding, you know, minding their own business. I'm just trying to figure out how this terminal works because it's not picking up eggs for whatever reason. Okay, I have no idea what I just did. <laughs> uh, no idea what I just did, but anyway. Capture release. Allow Lyle Pluridon capture. Anyway, let me uh, let me tell you what I have planned for today's episode while I look at this. I want to tame a Moza. I want to go after a Moza. A relatively high level Moza. Because I want something strong. Yeah, like, I want to tame a Moza and I want to go ahead and... Let me see. Hide range. I think it's this. Yeah, it's that. There we go. Alright, anyway. Yeah, for some reason, it's not picking up the eggs. Don't know why. It just isn't. Okay, hold on. Uh, can we please just... Pick that up. I'm just gonna disable mating for right now. Just so I can do whatever, alright? Well, so yeah, I wanna go out and tame a Moza. And, uh, after that... Speaking of breeding, I want to do some breeding after the Moza tame. What I want to do is breed up some of the Rexes, try to get two of the perfect ones, the perfect male and the perfect female, same level. That's what I'm trying to do. Same level. That way there, we'll have, like, the same levels, same stats, and then we'll be able to tame whatever. So, we got the kibble. I'm just going to put this in the fridge for now. This bug stuff, insect stuff. Alright, so what do we need? I think I think it's the females both. 41, 41, 12, 83. 44, 11, 13, 69. Okay, so we need both of the female stats. That's what we need. So what did we get for this Zephactinus here? Alright, we kept the stats for that one. This one lost 41. No, this one lost the health. Never mind. I'll let them keep breeding at some point. All right, anyway, let me, uh, we got the gecko. Let me go get my mask. Is it in my inventory? Yes, it is. Okay, awesome. I think we're good to go with the Mosa. Oh, I don't have any food in my inventory. I'm sure Mufasa's got some food inside of him. I forgot these doors open automatically. <laughs> Alright, so Mufasa, there you are. Oh yeah, cooked meat for days. Let's go. I'm just going to put some more stuff away because I don't need a lot of this stuff, like this chitin. Don't know where I got this chitin. Probably from the Dunkleosteus or whatever. Look at that. Our, our crossbow is already almost broken again. Can we fix this? Yes, we can. Awesome. I'm just going to go ahead and get some more arrows. Yeah, I just got bored one day and just decided to create more arrows. Alright, there we go. 93 should be more than enough. If we find a better crossbow, or better yet, a rifle, then we'll be good to go. But for now, let's go on our little adventure. Now that there's, now that we're looking for a Moza, there's going to be none around. Well, when we've been finding Mozas, they've been, they've been everywhere. 130's been the highest we've seen. Let me just, uh, I guess put the Zephactinus saddle back on one of the Zephactinus. Alright, let's take the Dinosuchus out. You're the only thing big enough to stand a chance, really. Alright, we got nine levels. Let's go up in melee all the way. Alright, Dinosuchus, let's go. Let's see if we can find a Mosasaur. They're usually down under the sea and whatever. Like in the dark depths. Alright. We're looking for a Mosa. 
I don't know if we'll be able to get the saddle right away, but we'll definitely be able to... Yeah, whatever. Alright. If we find a Tylosaurus, we'll go after that too. We've got... We got 13 kibble. Most things really take just the one. We got a Dunkelostius. Hello, max level Dunkelostius. I'm not after you, but... I'm not opposed to taming a quick Dunkelosteus. I mean, you are female. We have a female back at the base. But you could have better stats. And you're kind of a nice color, too. You know what? Should we do a quick Dunkelosteus tame? Go on. Let's do a quick Dunkelosteus tame. But it's a max level. I, I don't... I never say no to max levels. And it's a Kind of a nice color, too. So, uh, I'll just knock this guy out, and then we'll go from there. Oh, okay. Uh, of course, you've got friends. Why wouldn't you have friends? Now, where did it go? And down he goes. Awesome. Alright, he's got another friend after me, so we'll go after his friend. And then I'll put the kibble in him, and then I'm just going to leave him here. Alright, you'll only just take the one kibble, right? Yeah, just the one. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and put a couple in your inventory. Just in case. Alright, let's go restock up on arrows. And probably... I think my crossbow should be fine. I don't think we need to fix it. I should tame one of you two. I've got kibble. You're a level 90, so I won't tame you. I'd like to get like a 130 or something. Or 145 or whatever. Alright, we're about to get a max level Dunkelosteus, and it's not too far from the base either. So, yeah, we got that Dunkelosteus, even though it is a female. Another female. That's fine. That's fine. I had a chance to tame a high level male, but you know what? We're fine. We're good. Alright, so let me just restock up on arrows. Alright, as long as we stay out of render distance with the Dunkelosteus, we should be fine. Alright, let's head back into the ocean. Find ourselves a Moza. We should be good to go. Alright, let's go down into the ocean. Alright, the Dunkelosteus is still within render, so a Megalodon could attack it if it wanted to. I like going underwater now. The center is kind of just filled with magnificent creatures. I also added in a few more mods. I re-added the Seahorse mod. Which is really good. That's a 145. There we have it. Dolly has been tamed. Uh, okay. Why can't I pick you up? It's not allowing me to pick him up for whatever reason. I must have changed the settings at some point. Okay, we can't we can't have that. We can't have that. Just follow me home, I guess. We got a 145 anyway. I'm just going to take you back home and then I'm going to and then I'm going to figure out what to do with that cuz we can't we can't have that. We can't disable that. For whatever reason. Alright, Croc, you stay here. I'm gonna bring this guy into the base. Wait, let me see if I can... Okay, okay I can capture you. For some reason, though, it's not allowing me to capture the... The dolly. Okay, I captured the Megalodon. You actually had arrows on you. Alright, well... I'll worry about that later. We got one of those dolly things anyway. Alright, for real this time. Let's go find ourselves a Moza. The Dunkelosteus should tame with no problem. I don't think we need the, um... What's it called? Alright, there's a jellyfish. I think that's a jellyfish. That's good to know for when we need biotoxin. We could just use the Nothosaurus or the Basilosaur for that. 
Swim a little further down. There's one right here. Okay, 145. That's perfect. 145. All right. We're going after that. And you should take just the one. Oh, you take four kibble. Good to know. All right, 28,000 torpo. Let's start. 51 damage. That shouldn't be a problem. Let me just pamper this guy with arrows. Come here, Mr. 145 Mosasaur. Alright, how? There's an Alpha Mosasaur just glitched over here. I should probably get rid of that. Okay, I keep missing. How do these arrows keep missing? Okay, there we go. We gotta hit in. That one did 102 damage. We, we have 100,000 health, so we should be good to go. I've never actually tamed a Moza before. Okay, can you not be behind me when I'm trying to shoot you? I want you to be in front of me, not behind. We've been getting really lucky with the high levels. Really lucky. We're about to get a max level Dunkleosteus and a near max level Mosasaurus. You're going to require four kibble. I think you, I think I need to babysit you, because your Torpor drops very quickly, I do believe. So I think I do have to babysit you. I don't have to babysit the Dunkleosteus, but the Moza, I do have to babysit. That was also a miss. And down you go. Yeah, one minute. Yeah, I'm going to have to babysit you. All right, we got kibble for days. I'm going to put half of that in your inventory. All right, so I'll babysit this guy real quick. And uh, I guess I'll let you guys know when this Mosasaur tames. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. Oh, and by the way, for those of you wondering how I'm breathing underwater without a scuba tank, the gecko over here provides me with unlimited oxygen. So that's what's going on here. And there we have it. Both the Mosasaur and the Dunkleosteus have tamed up. So I'm just... I got the Mosa done. Let's, uh... Let's go grab the Dunkleosteus, and we should be good to go. A max level. The Alpha Mosa's under there. Yeah, right under the ground. It's just stuck on the cliff. I'm gonna use the Gigabyte. We did about 50,000 damage with the bite. That's insane. That was a 55. Damn. All right, we'll take both of them back to base. The Moza might be too big to fit in the, the pen. The pen is kind of getting a little crowded, in my opinion. So what I might do is start releasing some... Some stuff over by the coast. All right, Dinosuchus, as always, you did a really good job. You've been my go-to creature when it comes to aquatics. And I'm proud of you. There we go. All right, so let me compare the two Dunkleosteus first before we move on to the Moza. All right, where's Uncle Dunkle? This is Uncle Dunkle, the 130 that we tamed. You initially had 47 points into health. 32 into stamina, 40 into food, 39 into weight, and 35 into melee. And now this new one has 41 into health, 54 into stamina, 42 into food, 40 into melee, into weight, and 46 into melee. Okay, so you've got better melee, but not as good health. All right, well, we'll keep you... Great, I'm stuck inside you. Wonderful, Uncle Dunkle. All right, let's check out the Moza. What are your stats, buddy? Let's see. 48 points into health, so you've got pretty good health. 38 into stamina, 48 into food, 48 into weight, and 34 into melee. Leave you out here, and you're kind of a blue Mosasaur. I kind of like that. I don't know if you're like bog standard colors or anything like that, but I kind of like that. Luckily, the Dinosuchus should have plenty of whatever. There we go. And now for the next thing on the agenda. Maybe get a saddle for the Moza. 
see what it's all about. I'll do that at the end. But I'm just gonna get, like, a breeding pair of Rexes that are the same level. That's something I want to do. Alright, so... Let's go over to the breeding pen. I think we do have a couple of Vectospinus. That are the same exact level, which is perfect. As for the Rexes... Let's just get some Rex eggs. I only have one Rex egg. Oh, you're not on mating. Behavior, enable mating. And you're like super hungry. Super hungry. Let me, uh. Who else is super hungry? Hmm. Yeah, you guys are hungry. Alright, let me go. Let me go grab some food real quick. That isn't really cooked. I know the Vectospinus might eat the fish, but will the Rexes eat it? Are you guys eating it? Okay, you're kind of full. Okay, yes you are. Yes you are. Okay, that's good. Let's look up 231. We've got males. What about 232? We've got a female 233. Four, five, six. Alright, so 232 seems to be the highest. So 230. 29, 28, 7, 6, we got 126, 25, 4, they're both male, 23, 35, 37, that's bang on, okay, one of them has different oxygen, but that shouldn't be too much of a problem, alright, we kind of got the same stats, we got two 223s, so we should be good to go. These guys are fully good to go. We have two that are the same exact level. Let's go ahead and... Behavior. Enable mating. Behavior. Enable mating. There we go. I'm kind of trying to get some mutated pyromanes if I can. I was going to say, don't tell me we're out of fish already. Alright, well, while I wait for the Rexes to kind of do their thing, I'm just going to go ahead and uh, craft up the Moses Saddle. So what do we need for a Mosasaur Saddle? We just need Silica Pearls, Cementing Paste, Fiber, and Metal. Fiber, not a problem. Cementing Paste, not a problem. Metal should not be a problem. Silica Pearls... Not a problem. Alright, that should be everything we need for the Moses Saddle. We're gonna make the regular one for now. 1,200 metal ingots for the platform. That's a lot. Yeah, we're not getting a platform saddle unless we find it in a drop. If we find it in a drop, then that's fine. Alright, Dinosuchus. You can stay there, I guess. Let's test out our Moza. You've got really good health. 48 points into health. Uh, we got the saddle. Let's take our new Mosasaurus out for a spin. Let me put on the mask. So I can see a bit better. Alright. Our new Mosasaurus. I want to get a good pick of it. For the thumbnail. Alright, let's find something to kill. Dunkelosteus has armor. There's the 20 vassal. Let's see. 910. That's really good. 910 damage right off the bat. Hello, Pelican. I'm about to kill you. If you don't mind. Get around here. 2700. I think we just got a headshot. I think that's with a headshot. That's really cool. That's a 135 Prion. Let's just kill this guy real quick. We're still hitting it somehow. There we go. We start off with 24,000 health. That's really good for a Moza. Alright, we got 44 levels. I'm thinking we put... We got... Wait. 
Weight we don't have to worry about. Stamina we don't really have to worry about. Let's get the health up. Let's get 22 points into health. Okay, alright, 23. And then just put the rest in the melee. We got 274,000 health. Yeah, we're unstoppable. Let me just see how much damage we do. 5,400. That's really good. What was this best? Sort of 45? Let me just go ahead and kill you. 2100 with a Dunkelostius. Yeah, Dunkelostius do less damage. That's a 100 Basilosaur. Okay, we need to turn around. So we can fight these guys head on. And we got all the Mantas arriving. Alright, let me get in a good position where I can turn around and face you all. Alright, come at me. Bring it on. There we go. We should be good to go. Alright, we might worry about the Rex breeding next episode because that's going to take a little bit for them to breed up. But the main thing is we got the Mosasaurus. That's the main thing. That's all I ever care about. We got the main prize. And a, a free Dunkelosteus as well. A max level Dunkelosteus. Which has better health, but not as good melee. And you kind of like bright blue. I kind of like that. The reason it's got red is because I've been leveling it up. The Mosasaur does need a TLC because the model itself looks hideous, but the color makes it look gorgeous. Alright. Excuse me. Let me just check on the Rexes. See how many eggs they've produced. And if not, we'll wait till next episode to breed them up. Next episode, I'm thinking about going back into the Redwoods, taming one of those Diamantinosaurus. Let me guess. Yeah, we're out of fish already. Alright, I'm gonna have to get some more food. Just so they these guys don't go hungry and whatever. But yeah, I'm gonna do that on my spare time. But in the meantime, that's going to have to wrap it up for this episode. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. But until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.